So if you're wondering why babies are not being born in Jamaica, here is why. With Jamaica's recording a reduction in birth rates in recent years, obstetrician and gynecologists are blaming skin bleaching creams for lower sperm count in the island's younger generation of men. Along with the country's recording low birth rates in recent years, the medical practitioners are fearful that infertility is on the rise among both genders in Jamaica. So when them want to talk about, oh, the girls are having abortion, oh, the girl are dash with belly, oh, them come like cemetery, they are also the issue. Addressing the topic last Thursday, during the American College of Obstetrian and Gynecologists West Indies Section's infertility update held at the summit in Kingston Hotel in New Kingston was Dr. Kamali Carroll, lecturer and chief embryologist, Caribbean Fertility Center, who represented on the decrease and decline in overall sperm count quality worldwide. It has really become an interesting problem because we are not really able to identify exactly what is happening and why it's happening, but there are certain risk factors that have become very highlighted in recent years. So, for example, the increase in obesity, the increase in chronic illness, excessive use of marijuana, and notice I said excessive. But these are all of some of the things that are contributing, Carol told the Gleaner. In terms of locally, a big issue that we're having here and seeing is a lot of young men coming with decreased sperm counts and it's associated with skin bleaching creams. And yes, we need to educate them and tell them, we tell them a lot of the times your sperm count is low. We notice that you are using these creams that are not good for your sperm count. So you kind of need to ease up on them, but they choose not to. And so we really need to do a lot more in terms of education and research of that. Director Jordan Hardy, Chairman AC. OG West Indies section, which is the largest group in the Western Hemisphere, was also one of the numerous panelists who stressed that infertility is on the rise among the Jamaican population and drew on data for his arguments. The Reproductive Health Survey noted a decline in birth rates from 4.5 in 1975 to 1 1.9 in 2021. And what is the great concern is that we are noting a decline in fertility in both genders. So you know how Jamaican people stay, especially the men. The men like to blame the woman. Oh, the woman, the woman, the woman. She dash her belly. She a cemetery. Okay. She a barren well it may be you sir you may need to go check up your sperm count you may just need to stop bleaching you may need to stop drinking ray and his nephews you may need to stop drinking boom you may need to go exercise anyways <laughs> So, male semen quality and the sperm count are falling and our women, many of them are having challenges achieving pregnancy. So, we are here to discuss different techniques and technologies we have at our disposal to assist our patients in achieving their fertility, Hardy told the Gleaner. So the treatment option include ovulation induction is basically looking at a woman who are trying to get pregnant. Maybe they don't have regular periods. They don't ovulate. So it's actually devising a plan through medications and procedure to help conceive. And I see a lot of people talking about, well, I didn't see a lot of people. I saw one guy on social media talking about how the girls love his bleached skin. And this man actually looked like a whole ghost. He look like something that is not even from this world. He looks like an alien. And to all the Jamaican women that are telling these men this BS, please stop. Because they do not look good. Majority 
of them that I have seen do not look good. They don't look attractive. The morals of Jamaican women have declined so far that they think someone that look like a ghost alien is attractive. So please advise the bleachers that when they're bleaching out their skin, the baby is not going to come out looking like the bleach skin. The baby is actually going to come out looking like the skin that they were before they bleached the skin. Also, the bleaching is making their sperm count low. Them can't have no pitney. Them can't reproduce. Them barren. Them not have no use. <laughs> All right, so with that being said, Please implore Jamaican men, whether they're bleacher or not, to take care of themselves and their health because that's the only way that we're going to get the birth rate up and there are going to be more Jamaican people being born. So, like, comment, share, subscribe, leave your comments in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.